renowned constitutional lawyer Kayode Ajulo has cancelled lawyers against politicizing the issue of obtaining 25% in FCT as a requirement to win the presidential election. Mr. Yolo said this on Sunday in Abuja against the backdrop of some lawyers insisting that securing 25% of votes in FCT was necessary to secure victory for any presidential candidates. Peter B, the candidate of the Labour Party, secured 25% in FCT in the February 25th January elections. While the president elect Bola Tinumbu, the APC candidate scored 20%. This has generated several comments and reactions from legal practitioners. Why some give credence to the 25%, others said the FCT should be treated as a state. Mr. Julo, however, said politics had missed with the law to please certain quarters of political class, adding that it was a dangerous mix. There is politics and there is the law, and why they can sometimes intersect, they should not be modeled up when discussing pertinent legal issues the lawyer said he said such legal issues could affect the country and the collective development of our citizens he said it was disturbing when some of his professional colleagues analyzed issues of the 25 percent requirement saying some comments were uncomfortable and a gross misinterpretation some lawyers give certain legal opinions they do not even believe in because of policies it is the common man on the street that suffers this dangerous game of deliberate misinterpretation of our law. Mr. Julo said the deliberate misinterpretation of some lawyers was a mockery of the nation's constitution and the legal profession, adding that such had a way of turning to haunt its makers. He said it was imperative to set the record straight amidst the brouhaha surrounding the interpretation of Section 134.2 of the Constitution and the multifarious explanations by public commentators and senior lawyers. Mr. Julo further said there was a need to state the true position of the law, devoid of emotion and political sentiments. He said candidates for an election to the office of the presidential be deemed to have been duly elected where there have been more than two candidates for the election. First, he has the highest number of votes cast at the election and secondly, he has not less than one quarter of the vote cast at the election in each of the last to third of all the states in the Federation and the FCT. According to him, even though the FCT is not a state, the Constitution has clothed it with the toga of a state and all the powers of a governor in a state are vested in the minister of the FCT. He said why the Houses of Assembly of the 36 states of the Federation legislate for each state respectively. The National Assembly makes laws for the FCT. Mr. Ajulo said that while the states had at their respective local government areas, the FCT also had area councils. The constitutional lawyer said a, re a reasonable, just and sensible interpretation of section 134.2 would then be that scoring 25% of the vote cast in the FCT is like scoring 25% in other states of the federation hmm. so is your own interpretation that will be okay whether we um, in, and interpret it like this or the other way but at the end of the day the court is going to judge this whole thing but i don't even know why we don't even the law some of the laws that are even clear for these people to even obey is, is a problem even is it not buhari there just to obey the 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 court order he does not even obey it there's nothing too hard to that effect you see in Namdekano, what do you need to interpret the god the only thing the masses and everybody whether you are law inclined or whatever is is being discharged and acquitted malami came and tell us that uh, he's, he was only discharged discharge he was not acquitted hey you see so the issue is that the whole thing uh, the thing is 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 choking He's choking Tinumbu on the neck. He's still choking Tinumbu on the leg. It'd be like bone. Where they your neck? You know if you swallow her, 
you know fee come out time for your mouth that is just the meaning of this because you are interpreting it in one way and interpreting it the other way others are interpreting it in, in another way the only person that i i'm I, I am really i really believe i'm believing in all of this is is this man the man called igini mike igini who has been working in i neck for god knows when before uh, i think it was on the 24th of a uh, of yeah 24th of february that was where the man came out he said you must win get 25 percent in fct he made it clear so he's a lawyer himself also he worked as i uh, officer for close to how many years so he should know what he's talking about so he was not just talking about oh talking as a normal eye neck personnel even some eye neck personnel will be able to tell you this is the way it is because they are the one in charge of this whole thing they are the one in charge of this whole thing and why is it that this issue of 25 percent will not be under you know understood by everybody and also how did they or Basajo or Jonathan or even Buhari himself did he win FCT because if these are the leads lay down rules and regulation because i have never seen anybody referring to any of these people that say oh this one did not win now why is it that uh, but uh, he was able to be de they were able to declare him the winner nobody has mentioned any of them did uh, buari in win in fcc did Gula jonathan win in fcc what about a uh, late yara Dura? did he win in fcc those are the questions we need to be asking ourselves so why is it that uh, this issue of 25 percent is not a big deal because it is something that we ought to have known as a people so it is not now you are we are not going to be going back and forth we'll be going back and forth this is the way it is this is the, the way it is not supposed to be where well, another emotional laddened lawyer Ajilo, hmm, interesting where you told yoruba person the meaning of a holani i think man name amounts I think a man named amongst the lawyers won the candidate is parading. I don't understand the statement of this one. That part of the law is unambiguous. It says 25% into third of the state and FCT. What is the uh, means? What this means is that after getting those 25% into third of the state, you must also. Hmm, have 25 percent in the fcc to be declared winner okay uh, okay it's not supposed to be too hard what of buari and the rest of them did they win 25 percent in abuja that's that's it because i i didn't i i'm sure this is this law did not just came on board the law did not just come on board though <laughs> so guys uh, let's hear your opinion and have your take